Hello everybody, I'm Richard Holder. Thanks for joining me on another episode of Speed Secrets. Today we're working with the guys from Comp Camps, and it's all about a cam swap on a stroke or small block. Now just to be thorough, we ran the cam swap both normally aspirated and turbocharged. So what are we waiting for? Let's check out that test motor and jump on the dyno. Our 420 inch stroker featured an aftermarket block with a 4155 bore and 38750 stroke. The stroker was topped with a set of Brodex aluminum 235 heads and a matching single plane intake. Because it was designed for boost, it had a low 8.5 to 1 compression. Mild camshaft number one. Up on the dyno. Mild cam had plenty of torque. Our stroker produced 467 horsepower and 495 foot pounds of torque. With the first of our cams out of the way, it was time for a cam swap. We removed the rockers and intake. Then the lifters. Next came the front cover. Followed by the cam gear including the cam button. Then we swapped the cams and lined up our timing gear. With camshaft number two in place, let's check out those specs and see how it did. Camshaft number two. Even more power than the mild cam. Some good power gains. After the installation of our medium size camshaft number two in our 420 inch stroker, the power output jumped to 508 horsepower and 505 foot-pounds of torque. That's a gain of 41 horsepower over the milder cam, although there were trade-offs in torque below 4,000 RPM. Now that we've run the camshaft comparison in normally aspirated trim, it's time to install the turbos and repeat the test. Twin 76 millimeter turbos with a blow-through carburetor, then run with camshaft number one. Healthy power curve. Now that we've installed the turbos on our 420 inch small block, it's time to repeat our cam swap procedure. First up was the milder of the two cams. Equipped with that mild cam, our turbo small block produced 658 horsepower and 677 foot pounds of torque. Now that's at a peak boost, just over five and a half pounds. Now that we've installed the milder of the two cams, it's time to step up to camshaft number two. Then swap the cams and back under boost over 700 horsepower with impressive gains. Okay guys, the results are in. Equipped with camshaft number two, the power output of our turbocharged small block jumped to 714 horsepower and 691 foot-pounds of torque. Those are gains of 56 horsepower. Now you'll remember when we ran the same cam swap on the normally aspirated motor, the gains were 41 horsepower. Now they've jumped up to 56 horsepower. So it just goes to show you the original gains were multiplied with the presence of boost. I'm Richard Holdner. That's all the time I have. I want to thank the guys at Comp Cams. Join me next time on Speed Secrets.